theme or a new topic. It's going to be very educational. Uh, it's going to be very, very noteworthy taking. And, um, and uh, with that being said, we do ask that you trade responsibly along the way. As we analyze the Forex market, we will be getting into the live market. We will be looking at up-to-date live feeds and giving overall direction based off the education we learned today. With that being said, we do ask that you trade responsibly. Only look to risk funds to where as if you are to lose them, it will not affect your everyday lifestyle. Furthermore, also understand that's part of the reason why you are here. You are here to learn how to minimize your risk and to maximize your reward. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started. Today we're going to be discussing the ABCDs of Forex market direction. And uh, we understand that throughout this series that some of you may stay with us through the entire Monday through Friday series, while others, today may be your only day you join. Be that as it may, in the very beginning of our series, for the first five to seven minutes, we're just going to give a, a quick recap of what the Forex market is for all the new traders in the room, as well as who we are, and then we'll get right into the live market. So let's get started with who we are. Who is MTI? MTI stands for Market Traders Institute. We were founded by Jared Martinez in February of 1994. And we are located in Lake Mary, Florida, United States. MTI operates under a single mission, which is to create successful Forex traders. And since client satisfaction is such high importance to Market Traders Institute, we have designed all of our client interaction around a single sentence. We never leave a client behind. Over the last 20 years, we've had the honor and the opportunity with working with over 30,000 clients from all corners of the world. Therefore, we employ over 100 of the most talented staff members in this industry ready to serve you. So what is the Forex? Because that is our topic of the day. The Forex market is the largest financial market with almost limitless amounts of liquidity, which really means it is a market of limitless financial opportunity. What the Forex market means to me is that it is the easiest, most predictable, and safest way to invest. If you take a look at this graph on your page, this shows you the comparison of the average daily trading range of the Forex against three other world markets. So according to SumerForex.com, you have the Forex market that has over $5 trillion traded within a 24-hour period back and forth. If you compare that to the New York Stock Exchange, the Tokyo Stock Exchange, and the London Stock Exchange, you add all those three world markets up, it will not even equal to what the Forex market has to offer in a single day. So because of that, some of the world's top investors trade the Forex market, as well as some of the world's richest men. Go ahead and type in a me or a why or yes if you know who uh, George Soros or Warren Buffett is. These are some of the richest men on the planet. And here at Market Traders Institute, we firmly believe in modeling. If the top investors in the entire world are trading the Forex market, then we believe that we should all be trading the Forex market. Another key reason to trade the Forex market is the fact that we have access to the most buying power. Here in the United States, we trade with 50 to 1 leverage, which simply means if you were just to take $20, and enter into a position, it's known as a micro lot position. You would control about $1,000 of buying and selling power. If you kick it up a notch and trade a standard position, which is a 2,000 US dollar investment per trade, you would control about $100,000 of buying and selling power. It's known as trading a standard position. When used properly, leverage can safely catapult your profits. The Forex market is also open 24 hours a day, five and a half days a week. So let me ask a quick question. Uh, go ahead and recognize yourself if you work a day job, if you work a nine to fiver. So that's Pete, that's Philip, that's Connie, that's Garrett, that's uh, Roderick, um, Danielle, actually not Danielle, uh, Victor, and uh, there's quite a few of us. The reason why I ask that question is if you work a day job, it can be kind of difficult to trade in any other world stock market because your hours while you're at work is pretty much the same hours that the market's open. But if you traded the Forex, which is a 24-hour market, you would have the ability to 
to trade before work or after work when you're able to and work on building some sort of supplemental income. And if it became really good, you can replace your entire income. So let's get, let's get talking about the good stuff. Uh, how do you make money in the Forex market? Well, um, what we're trying to do is we're trying to capture what's called a PIP, which is a price interest point. A PIP is the acronym of a price interest point. And a PIP has the same relationship as a penny does to a U.S. dollar. Let me explain to you what I mean. Uh, one U.S. penny represents one one-hundredth of a U.S. dollar. That same relationship helps us determine what a PIP is to a penny. Because a PIP represents one one-hundredth of a penny and that's what you and I are trading. We are simply trading fractions of pennies inside the Forex market. But the value of your PIP is worth much more than a fraction of a penny. So for those of you that have pens and papers, this is what I want you to write down. We trade what's called lots. Uh, you have the ability to trade what's called a mini lot or a standard lot. And depending on your broker, you should be able to trade what's called a micro lot. We're only going to be talking about minis and standard lots today. A mini lot means that your one pip is valued at one U.S. dollar, and it costs you about 200 U.S. dollars on average to enter into the market. A standard lot is what's going to be the primary topic of today's examples, is when your pip value is equal to 10 U.S. dollars and your average investment size is 2,000 US dollars per trade. This is an extremely important part before we get into the live market. Please be so kind, just type in a Y or a yes if you understand that as Forex investors, we buy and sell PIPs. And a PIP is what stands for price interest point, which is just a fraction of a penny. And if you invest $200 into a trade, your PIP is worth $1 on average. Or if you invest $2,000 US dollars into a trade, your PIP is worth on average $10. So if you discuss, or let's just say, for an example, you trade a standard lot. If you make 10 PIPs, you just made $100. But if you lose 10 PIPs, you just lost $100. That's how we make money and lose money in the Forex market. So who am I and why should you listen to me? I am Market Traders Institute's product expert. I have trained thousands of Forex investors. I have turned an initial deposit investment of 500 US dollars and have generated over 39,000 US dollars of profit. I have made thousands of Forex investments. I am a published author, international speaker, professional analyst, and a full-time trader. And what I want to do is share with you what I've been able to accomplish inside the Forex market and show you those same tools and strategies in the Forex market with our Fibonacci and ABCD. In front of you is my personal account activity statement. This is a snapshot of my personal trade, trading account. On June 5th, 2011, I opened up a trading account with $500. Uh, at first, I wasn't very good. I traded the smallest lot size, which is a micro position, where every pip is worth cents. When I first started trading, I was losing between three and five dollars per trade, and when I was winning, I was winning between two and eight dollars a trade. Really, what wasn't going were fast. I started to learn the same lessons that you're going that you're going to learn this week through Market Traders Institute. And within about a year and a half, I took that trading account, and I started producing returns of four thousand five hundred and sixty U.S. dollars a trade. 2,542 US dollars trade, withdrawing $10,000 at a time. Before I was a Forex trader, I was a personal trainer. And it used to take me, 10, it used to take me six months as a personal trainer to make $10,000. In the Forex market, I have days where I generate upwards of 7,598 US dollars. The neat thing about these results is they are third party verified through myfxbook.com. MyFXbook.com is where tens of thousands of investors bring their trading accounts to have them third party verified. Uh, my trade, uh, rec my uh, track record is verified. My trading privileges is verified. This is a real US dollar trading account. 
So we have a 4,548.82% return on the investment, the initial deposit investment. The reason why I'm showing you this isn't to say, look how good of a trader I am. The reason why I'm showing you this is to say, look at the results that were produced by the strategies you're about to learn, because this is a learned skill. Uh, just the other month, I had a 8,800 US dollar return on one single day. So just by show of response, by just typing a me or yes or absolutely, if these types of returns or results are the types of strategies you want to learn. I'm not saying you're going to make 8,800 US dollars tomorrow. That's, it took me about a year and a half to get to this level. But what would an extra 5,000 US dollars a month do for you? What if you were able to make between four and 5,000 dollars a month, month after month after month, starting next month? Could it make a big difference in your financial life? If your answer is yes, then you come to the right place because that's what our goal and objective is for this week, to teach you how to do that. We're going to teach you by utilizing the ultimate trader's package on demand. This is your on-demand financial freedom solution. This package is the most complete, turnkey, easy to use, step-by-step -step trading program available in this world today. So let's go ahead and discuss the ABCDs and Forex market direction. Thank you so much, Eric J., for the fantastic uh, motivation. I do appreciate that, my friend. So in front of you is our wealth acceleration software. And this is what we're going to utilize to read and understand the Forex market. We're going to be discussing ABCDs and Fibonacci's. And the first thing that I need to do is teach you the strategy and the concept. Once I teach you the strategy and the concept, we'll go ahead and look at live charts and plan for this week. And uh, see what trading opportunities are there for those of you that do have live trading accounts. So <clears throat> the very first thing I want you to notice is that we are looking at Japanese candlestick charts where every candlestick represents one hour of trading. So these are one hour charts. You have these dark candlesticks which, met, which represent downward or bearish movement and then you have these white candlesticks which measure upward or bullish movement. Now one of the things I want you to keep in mind is how this market moves. Now the market moves making lower lows and lower highs, lower lows and lower highs. And when the market rallies up, the market makes higher highs and higher lows, higher highs and higher lows. Please be so kind to type in a wire yes if you can see the market pattern that the market's going to move in waves rather than a straight line. Lower lows, lower highs on the way down, and higher highs and higher lows on the way up. What you need to understand as a Forex investor, and what really separates the great traders versus just the okay traders, is understanding whether you're in a short-term retracement versus a long-term extension. And today's goal is all about you understanding whether or not you're in a short-term retracement or a long-term extension because if you can determine which direction you're in, either a pullback or an extension, you will have a huge competitive edge over the Forex market. So <clears throat> we're going to be discussing and talking about ABCDs, which is going to assist us with our Fibonacci movements. Now, when this market moves, I think we can all agree that this market moves making higher highs and higher lows, higher highs and higher lows. This is known as an ABCD pattern. And we're going to discuss this movement here, A to B, C to D. And I'm going to assist you today in determining how to find your proper A and how to find your proper B. Furthermore, how to identify the C and then how to identify the D. Understand this, short term pullback, okay? Short term pullback, the B to C movement is a short term move. Long term extension from C to D is a long term move. So 
There's going to be two questions I'm going to ask over and over and over and over and over again, and you have to, t you have to answer these questions. So question number one is this. Are we moving from B to C or C to D? And question number two is, is that a short term or long term move? Please be so kind of type in a yes when you have these two questions written down on a sheet of paper. This is a vital, vital part of understanding how to move Fibonacci's, how to trade ABCDs, and understanding whether you're in a short-term move or long-term move. Because I want you to really think about this. If you're in a short-term pullback, it really does not matter if you buy in here, here, or here, eventually the market goes your way. But if you're in a long-term extension, if you decide or make the mistake to try to sell while you're in an extension, either sell here, here, or here, while you're in extension, there's really no hope for you because the market is just going to keep going against you. And that's very vital into your understanding. Um, this is really going to touch a lot of traders' hearts and probably going to touch a lot of pain by asking this question. My question is this. This really goes out to my active traders. <clears throat> How many times have you lost money or, lo or lost trades either by you closing out early or your stop getting hit, which is an automatic exit to protect yourself, only to watch the market go your original direction? How many times does that happen? What I mean by that is how many times have you bought in the market? Let's just say here you bought in. The market turns against you, stops you out where you lose money, and then eventually it turns around and goes your way. And that's Dr. M, that's David, that's Bill, it's Harold, it's Victor. This should begin to fix that problem. Because when you can determine whether you're in a short-term move or a long-term move is really where you can begin to determine whether you should hold on to your position or you should dump your position. And it will help you determine your stop losses. Okay. So here's the deal. Everyone has, everyone has this written down because I'm about to delete it. This is basically, this is your takeaway. You, you have to understand, this right here is your takeaway for today's lesson. Are we moving from B to C or are we moving from C to D? And is it a short-term move or a long-term move? If you do not have this down, I'll be more than happy to go over it again more towards the end of this presentation, but we're going to go ahead and move forward. So let me teach you the concept, and then we're going to go ahead and go to the live market. Okay, the very first thing that you need to do is you need to determine whether you're in an uptrend or whether you're in a downtrend. The simplest way to determine if you're in an uptrend or a downtrend is to utilize hand-drawn trend lines. This is an appropriate down hand-drawn trend line, and this is an appropriate up hand-drawn trend line. Basically, what hand-drawn trend lines do for you is they separate the market into what's called a sell zone and what's called a buy zone. When the market is below your hand-drawn trend line, all you want to do is look to sell the market. When the market enters above your hand-drawn trend line, all you really want to do is buy this market. Right away, I think we can all determine and understand that we are now above this upward hand-drawn trend line, so therefore, we are considered in the buy zone. Once you determine your zones, you are then going to identify the lowest point of the trend. This, which I'm going to circle right now, this is the lowest point, and there should be no contesting whether there is a candlestick below this level. Because this is the lowest point of where the trend started, you're going to mark this with a blue horizontal line. That blue horizontal line immediately becomes your A boundary. This is the very, very first step in determining your AB boundary. Once we determine the A boundary, we are then going to back up the charts to only show the candlestick of that A. 
The reason why we do this is because it prevents confusion and making mistakes. If you make a mistake with your strategy, you, it, it's kind of like you're a few degrees off in your trip. Let's just say you're taking a plane cross seas and uh, you're a few degrees off, you're going to be uh, way off your destination. If you make a mistake with your Fibonacci's and your ABCD's, you're going to be way off on your projection. So this is an important step. Now, your A is determined by the lowest point of the trend. And also, is there, there is a requirement of having one, two candlesticks to the left, and one, two candlesticks to the right, which are higher than the center wick low. That is determined as your A. Your B is now moving forward from left to right and finding the first high with two candlesticks to the left and two candlesticks to the right, which are lower than the center wick high. Please be so kind to type in a yes if you can see that we have one, two candlesticks to the right and one, two candlesticks to the left, which are lower than the center wick high. Perfect. That is the first official high that formed after this A. This is not a proper high because we only have one candlestick to the right lower than this high. This is one, two candlesticks to the right, which are lower than the central wick high. Now, we're going to go ahead and move, or we're going to go ahead and mark our proper B. That high is our B boundary. Okay. Because this market moves in ways, making higher highs and higher lows, we're now searching for what's called the C. Once the C is determined, that will give us our D extension, which we'll discuss in just a moment. So here is my question to you. Is this market moving from the B to the C, or is this market moving from the C to the D? Type in, your, type in the question section box right now. Is it moving from B to C, or is it moving from C to D? If you don't know, just type in, I don't know. Dr. M says B to C. Ray says B to C. Stanley says B to C. Calvin says B to C. Paul says B to C. Okay, now, I agree. This market is moving from the B to the C. So is that a short-term move, or is that a long-term move? Is that a short-term retracement, which is a pullback? Or is that a long-term extension? It's a short-term move. So immediately, everyone in this room needs to understand that this downward movement that you're seeing is short-lived, which means we are only looking to buy this market towards the north. Do not make the mistake of trying to sell the market from the B to the C because you really never know when your C is found. So right away, what you need to determine is your stop. stop is determined before anything else. And a stop is what is an automatic exit for loss. Now, uh, the big question is, where do you place your stop? And um, why do you place it there? Because if you don't question the status quo of, of why, uh, growth and understanding is very difficult uh, to obtain. So I want everyone to understand this. Write this down. As long as, long as the market does not take out the A, the market has no choice but to go your way. This rhymes, and it's a nice thing. As long as the market does not take out the A, the market has no choice but to go your way. Write this down. It's a huge takeaway for today's lesson. Okay, so what does this mean? Well, it's simple. This basically means unless the market takes out this low, any downward movement you see is short term. Once the market takes out this low, that means we actually have a reversal. So there's your black and white line in the sand level. This blue line, your A boundary, separates the market from saying reversal, downward trend, or pullback. This blue line separates that. So B to C can be within one pip above the A. Because of that, we placed our stop below A. Now, once the market determines the C, we'll go ahead and teach you how to move your stop loss to minimize risk. But when you first start trading, 
you got to place your stock below DA. It just non-negotiably is what has to happen. If you say I can't risk that much, then lower your lot size. Because what would you rather have? A higher winning percentage trade or a lower physical risk with a higher losing percentage trade? Those are really your two choices. Would you rather win a would you rather have a higher winning percentage trade or just lower physical risk? You can always lower your risk with lowering your lot size. Okay, be that as it may, now here comes the last and final step. We're going to draw Fibonacci's. Fibonacci's are spread between the A and B boundary. Fibonacci's are the bread and butter to the Forex market. For those of you that know about American football, it is like a football player who squats and works out his legs all the time versus a football player that doesn't even touch their legs. Who's going to have more of a competitive advantage? The football player that works out their legs. Here in the Forex market, Fibonacci's give you such a huge competitive edge, it's unbelievable, and this is what you're learning. So between the A and the B boundary, you have what's called five Fibonacci retracement levels. The 0 0.382, the 0 0.50, the 0 0.618, the 0 0.76, and the 0.86 Fibonacci retracement. What these levels are, they are hidden U-turn levels. They're actually called hidden levels of support and resistance. But these hidden U-turn levels is where buyers will hang out. Literally, you have pending buy orders where once the market crosses over these levels, a bunch of buyers enter into the market, causing the market to go up. Above the B high, you have what's called the 1.18, the 1.27, and the 1.618, which are called Fibonacci extension levels. These are all the exit points or profit points determined by the retracement. <clears throat> so uh, for those of you who are confused by this, don't be. We actually color code this to make it really simple for you. The first three Fibonacci levels, you're going to notice that they are the color orange. And this orange color has an opposing orange color called the 1.618, which means if the market forms a low within the first three orange levels, which I'll go ahead and draw out for you, if we form a low higher than the A, you will expect the market to come all the way up to the opposite orange, which is your D extension. Okay? Now, if the market pulls back a little bit deeper and decides to come back, let's just say, to a green 786 retracement, which could be your C, uh, you're going to buy the market and hold on to it until it touches the green 1.27. Green goes to green. And if, let's just say, by chance the market pulls back to a blue 86 retracement, you'll buy that level at a candlestick formation, hold on to it until it touches a blue 1.18 because blue goes to blue. Let me show you in a live market scenario. This way it, it can all come together. Just understand a couple of things. We will teach you seven different ways to identify your C's, to limit out your D's, and I'm going to teach, and we'll also teach you in a checklist format so you're not making any mistakes. We buy what's called candlestick formations. This right here is called an engulfing bullish candlestick. This is your highest winning percentage opportunity for identifying your C. Candlestick formations are literally the sign language of the Forex market measuring the buyers versus the sellers and who's in control. This is a full body white bullish candlestick, which means within this one hour, the market closed above the open so great that it literally engulfed the previous one, two, three hours of downward movement. That is a huge percentage opportunity indicating that if you buy this market right now, you will have a high winning percentage chance of the market just going your way. So we are going to buy this market based off a orange 382 retracement candlestick formation, and we will reward ourselves, which is called a limit, which is an automatic exit, or profit at the opposite orange level, which is your D extension. Okay? So, <clears throat> Alex, this can be used on any currency pair in any time frame. The reason why we're utilizing the one hour time frame, simply put, 
it satisfies a lot of traders' um, credentials or criteria for trading this market. The one hour time frame or smaller provide less risk than the larger time frame of, let's just say, the daily time frame. Be it as it may, let me ask my question now. Is this market moving from B to C or is this market moving from C to D? Is this market moving from B to C or is this market moving from C to D? As of right now, according to what we have, this market looks as if it is moving from C to D. Is the C to D movement a long-term movement or is it a short-term movement? It is a long-term movement, which means if you try to sell the market right now, it's bad news for you. But if you try to buy this market, you're going to be in great shape. Furthermore, as long as the market doesn't take out the A, the market has no choice but to go your way. So if you buy the market right now, it's okay if we have a couple candlesticks that go against you because the bench market will be keeping you out of the way of the wave. So let's see what happens. Candlesticks one hour of trading. Let's measure how many candlesticks it takes to either stop us out or to hit our limit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We are ten hours into this trade. Here's my question: Did this take out the A? Yes or no? No, it did not. So four. This market has no choice but to go your way. This is a very great to be in. No need to close out early. It's 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. We're charged to trade. And we are in the profit, in the positive, and we are above, which is great. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 30. hours in this trade. A little bit of sideways movement, not a problem. This is okay. As long as the market doesn't take out the A, it has no choice but to go your way. Let's keep going. 31, 30, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37. 37 is late. The market fulfills the limit, which is the automatic exit. For Fibonacci points out the highest winning percentage Exit below the highest winning percentage entries. So the reason it was a good exit, watch what happens when you take your limit. The market you turn and to show movement, allowing you to maximize your profits. Pretty neat. Uh, the uh, overall movement or opportunity in which you captured but in the upper left hand side, look where it says range. This shows 128 pips. 128 pips, which is the equivalent to 1,200 US dollars. That's trading with a standard lot. Remember, when you trade with a standard lot, you're hit with on average $10. It costs you about 2,000 US dollars to enter a standard position. So here's my question. Would you be pretty happy making an additional 1,280 US dollars in the last 48 hours with only a 2,000 US dollar investment per this one trade? Yes. Investment return on investment, that's key. Furthermore, the actual size of the return begins to change a few people's potential uh, status, such as, what would an extra $1,280 do for your life in just the last two days? Okay, <clears throat> so I had to move our Fibonacci's and set up for the next trade. The deepest retracement between the A and the B boundary now becomes your A. The C is the deepest retracement between the A and the B boundary. Your D extension forms at mint, which is the proper high of one, two candlesticks to the left, one two count at lower and central book high. This becomes your new B and the process itself. Fibonacci will now be spread between the A and boundary. 
Once the A and B boundary are determined, and if it's spread, now the overall process starts all over again. So here's my question to everyone in this room. Is this market moving from B to C, or is this market moving from C to D? You tell me, market moving from B to C, or from C to D? Daniel says B to C, B to C, Bill says B to C. Now, is that a short-term move or a long-term move? You're correct. This is a short-term pullback, which means we need to buy this market. And we understand as long as the market doesn't take the A, any downward movement you see is considered short-term movement. This is a huge competitive edge uh, by identifying entries and exits in the growth or market. Now, the big question then becomes the following. How do you determine for C? So I want to ask you this question. Uh, type in a yes, or excuse me, type in how you find your C. How you find your C. William says he's going to use candlestick patterns. Type it in. If you don't know, just say, hey, I don't know. Um, William says candlestick patterns, O A L candlestick formation. Um, T H O says don't know. Country Lakes Grant says don't know. David says um, uh, pies. Roger says don't know. L M says don't know. Um, don't know. Pete says don't know. Philip says don't know. Okay, if you're saying you that's a problem. Okay? That, that's just straight honesty. That's a problem. If you have a solution, great. That's what we want. Now, we will teach you seven to determine your seat with a high winning percentage opportunity. And that's a whole other day and a whole other how to determine your actual seeds. But a couple of quick tips, something that can be really quick tip number one, use counsel information. This is called a piercing line. Sign are the sign language of the forex market, measuring the number of buyers versus sellers. This person will know it's a good idea to buy the market. The second, if you don't understand this information, okay, let's go ahead and bring in a counter trend line. A counter line is a trend that measures the retracement. Okay, that a counter trend measures short-term pullback. When the market closes above the counter trend line, it kind of signals that your C is potentially found. Okay? So, so there's two happen here. Number one, the market broke the counter trend line. Number two, the market performed uh, and then golfing bullish uh, right after forming a piercing line. There are three by this market will go, which means there's now a higher winning percentage chance the market's going to move from the which is your long-term move. This is a really, really good idea to buy the market right now. Understand that there's no such thing as 100% true absolutes, but this is a higher winning percentage rate if you... So, let's buy this market. We have less than a future orange goes to orange. Let's see what happens. Every count is an hour of trading. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, nine, ten. We are ten hours in this trade, and we are above, which means money. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 16 years later, we fulfill our limit. If you measure the distance from your tree to the count to the exit, if you take a look at the upper left hand side, you made 126 pips. 129 pips is equal to 1,290 US dollars trading a standard position. How many of you would be per happy with generating 1,290 US dollars in the last 20 hours? Dr. M says, yeah, of course. Ray says, yes. The bigger question is, what would you do with that money? What would you do and how could that change your life? Because if you can answer that question, that becomes your motivation on actually losing. Okay, so 
Notice how this market actually forms a proper high with one, two candles to the left and one, two candles to the right. It's over a high. Okay, real quick question um, audio. The side band from a zero being terrible, 10 being great. This is my audio. 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 8, 10. Okay, great. Much if um, uh, guys, uh, um, organizers, just uh, eat that on our side rather than the student side. Okay, let's keep going. Start at proper high. Let's move our Fibonacci's. Your C, which is the deepest trace to A and the B boundary, this C becomes the A. I that forms at the limit, which is your D, becomes your B. And now the process then repeats itself. D becomes A, D becomes B. So, let's go and continue forward. So here's my question. <clears throat> it's all about proper actions. If this is the A and this is the B, is this market moving from the B to, or is this market moving from the C to the D? You tell me. Paul says B. Dr. M says B to C. Ola says B to C. Lim says B to C. Now, next question. Is this a short-term move or is this a long-term move? Is this a short-term move or is this a long-term move? The short that huge competitive edge by understanding that if you try if you sell the market and the market begins to go against you, you really need to dump position and re-enter in buying. This also says don't this market because this is just a short-term move, a higher winning percentage trade to wait for the reverse and buy the market towards the north because there's more money paid that way and safer trade because that's the long-term move. So how do you determine your key? Okay, I'm going to give you two of the seven. You can either use a counter trend line break, which is just a measurement of the retrace, or just count information. Type in the chat box how you're going to find your C. Use candlestick formations, or are you going to use a counter trend line break, or maybe you want to use both. You want both. How are you going to determine your C? Dr. M will use both. All this is both. You're sitting here saying you don't know. That's a problem. And you're not preparing live. But if you can answer this question, that means you're making a commitment to yourself. This is a strategy that may work for your personality. Now, what you're learning. See what happens. Here we have a cannation letting you know it's time to buy the market. This is called an engulfing bullish camel. We do not have a counter trend line break. We still have to get a counter trend line break. We have to make readjustments uh, to the retracement because the angle traced as the angle changed as well. Okay, so here's my question. Do we one, two, three reasons to buy the market? Counter trend line break, two counts. Yes. Three reasons to buy the market. That's the trumps making our D extension the one point six one eight. Now, this does not mean that the market Market is one percent go your way right now. This just means that the market has the highest winning percentage of the U-turn. But as long as the market doesn't take out the A, the market choice to go. So let's see what happens. The market begins to go against us a little bit. Not a problem. Market back up. So it looks as if now we're back into the profit. And now, look at this, it's pulling back against us. OK? 
Okay. When this happens, then it takes place. There's two ways that you can look at this as. You can look at this as fearful. You can look at this as being a very terrible thing. A lot of traders probably right now in the room have the bad habit of closing out. Usually they close out early because they don't know if they're in the retracement. They also don't know if they're in the extent. They also don't um, know if the trade is even going to work out because they're very fearful. Let me ask this question. Has the now the S or no? William says no, says no. Victor says no. Dave says no. Olga says no. Gloria says no. No. And since it's not taking out the A, the market has no choice but to go your way. So therefore, as an educated trader using ABCDs and understanding this, saying that all this market did was pull back to a deeper C, which means that now whether or not you over leverage, that's that's a decision you have to make teach over here at Market Traders Institute. Second view of this is these are all different opportunities. These are all candlestick formations. These are all counter trend line breaks along the way that has provided multiple entries at a better position. So let's see what, as long as the market got the A, the market has no choice but to go your way. Here's my question to you. Did this model fill its D extension, which is your limit, which is your automatic exit for profit? As long as you fish in, because the market never took out the A, the market had no choice but to go your way. So therefore, your first entry, you generated, excuse me, you generated 104 pips which is an additional 1,460 U.S. dollars trading standard position. Okay, so I had one, two, three, four, five re-entries just trading counter trend line breaks. Top in the yes, and if you envision yourself trading with counter trend line breaks with Fibonacci. Yeah, that's Daniel, that's Gloria, that's Roger, that's me. Not Victor. So Victor, this may not be for you then. And that's that thing. If this isn't for you, then that's great. Because one of the things to understand is as a trader you have a decision on what strategy best fits your personality. That is why we teach seven different ways to find because there's seven major different types of personalities. Okay. <clears throat> so show you last example and I think everyone begins to have the concept down and then what we're going to go to the live market and show you how to apply this on, on the currency from time. So C becomes your A and the high, the D, becomes your B and cross this and repeat this up. To be. So here's my question to you. Are we from B to C moving from C to D? You tell me. Are we moving from B to C to D to B to C? Victor says B to C. William says B to C. Gloria says C. Is that a term move or is that a long term move? This is your takeaway from today's lesson. You have to answer this question. This is going to build a very strong foundation. To your okay, this is a short-term move, which means it would be a really, really, really big idea to sell this market right now because you're really looking to buy the market. So how are you going to determine your C? I've given you two, two ways your C. You can use classic formations or you can use counter trend line breaks. These are just very basic, basic entries. Okay. Roger's going to use candlestick formations. Ray, Gloria likes counter trend line breaks. Dr. M's going to use both. Daniel's going to use Stanley's going to use both. Okay, let's see what happens. Here we have both. We have what's called a morning star decision, and decision decision and a counter trend line break, meaning this is a very, very high winning percentage. 
very, very high winning percentage entry. This is where you really, really, really find the. Now, when you have less than a 3-2 bounce, let your be the one mix way because orange goes to orange. This part's already predetermined. Now, there's 100% absolutes or guarantees, but there is such thing as high winning percentage trade, high losing percentage trade. A very, very high winning percentage trade, letting us know that the market is in. So let's see what happens. Every candlestick represents one hour, and um, <clears throat> let's see how many hours is it there. Let me just stop us out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, ten. We are ten hours and. Money, 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 pips after pips after pips. These are fun. Enjoy them when you get them. Uh, it's a lot of fun. Uh, as you know, the last like this. Well, we're 10 hours in this trade. Now 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. In 15 hours, we limited ourselves out. Furthermore, look what happens. Our use forms a proper high, allowing you to maximize your profit. That was 200 how many of you in this room would be pretty happy generating about two thousand US dollars in twenty four hours? Everyone in this room have a long understanding of how this works before we go into the live market? Okay, remember two questions. Is the market moving from the B to the C or is the market moving from the C to the C? Those are curious. Uh, this was about um, two weeks of trading with four trades, so real, realistically it's not a lot of time. Um, four trades in two weeks doesn't really mean that you're having to uh, have a huge time commitment. You can enjoy your life, but this added up to uh, 1,280 plus 2,460 plus 1,290 equals 6,030 U.S. So the root is 6,030 U.S. dollars in about two weeks or trading with just a 2,000 US dollar investment per trade. How many of you think you could live with, and how many of you think that the growth opportunity can be explored? Absolutely. Okay, <clears throat> so let's get into the live market and let me show you how we use this in today's era, okay? This is the, we'll use the pound U.S. dollar, because I think a lot of you will be pretty happy with this. Do something really different. Uh, actually, not different, exactly what you just learned, but a little bit more to do, because this is really going to connect the dots. If you can understand this section, of, uh, I think you're going to be just fine. This is something that I wish someone would have taught as an investor when I first started trading um, rather than I had a later date. Okay, I'm going to first draw this out for you, and then we're going to get into the live industry, right? So we're going to look at two time frames, a daily time frame, and it needs to write this down. If you haven't done so, go ahead and do it. Uh, there's a really neat article to webinar software. On the upper right-hand side, I'm pointing to it right now with my mouse. I tell you it's ready to take a picture. Go ahead and click that button. It should automatically. Uh, if you don't see it, kindly you know minimize, not minimize, but um, or smaller, and then you should be able to see your overall picture. I think uh, what is it called? Uh, Restore down. Okay, so we're going to look at the daily time frame, and then we're going to look at the time frame, and we will separate the market with this line, like this. Okay. Now, the daily time frame, which will represent in orange, the market will move in higher and higher lows. And uh, you need an A, B, C to D movement. Now, the movement between to B, this is usually anywhere between 500 to 500 
a thousand pips worth of movement from A to B. The B to C movement is anywhere between 100 to 500 pips worth of retracement, and you have about a 500 to 1,000 pip another move. The daily will literally you and provide you the next 200 to 500 pip move and then retracement to 500 to 1,000 pip move. So here's my question before I show you this. You think a huge competitive edge if you are able to say, all I have to do is this market for the next 1,000 pips, or all I have to do is buy this mark for the next 1,000 pips. All I'm interested in doing, my game plan is just to buy this market for the next four months to make a thousand pips, one thousand U.S. dollar return on your investment, would it be a good competition to have as an investor? The answer is yes. A huge edge. Now, how we use this on a one-hour time is you have to understand that a one-hour time frame is exact. Now, every count will represent one-hour trading. As in a daily time frame, every count represents the movements are exactly the same except our time frame, 24 more candlesticks, so therefore you have more waves. The waves mean you have more opportunity, good opportunity and bad opportunity. You just have to say this opportunity and this is a good opportunity. We can answer that by looking at the larger. So this is what it looks like on a daily, this is what the one hour time frame looks like during the day, a bunch of little waves, higher highs, higher lows, higher highs, higher lows, higher lows. Now, as this mark is moving, what you can do is you can trace Fibonacci one hour time in the direction of the daily time frame. This pretty much makes the difference between professional investing versus Joe. Honestly, this is what took my trading to the next level. Now, if you lay this down, A to B, B to C, C to D, this is the same exact move. Please be so kind of type in a yes to understand that once we find the direction on the daily time frame, we can trade the smaller time frame. Now, why in the world you want a smaller time frame? Simple, better equity management. Smaller time frames have smaller candles, which means risk. Larger time frames have larger candles, which means larger risk. If you don't want to rush, use the larger time frames for direction and trade the smaller risk. It's a really, really wonderful tip. Okay, so you're not sure yet. Here, let me go ahead and reset this up. For those of you that are writing this down, this is what I want you to take down, and this is what I want you to take a picture of. Okay, take a picture of this right there. Take a picture of this. When you're done, I'm done. So you're going to take one more picture. This is part of your takeaways for today's lesson. Your picture is located on the upper right-hand side, or you can go ahead and draw it. If you can't find it, take out your take a picture of your phone. It's really neat. It's actually really neat. Okay. Okay, second thing. We're going to lay the daily time frame onto the movement. Now I'll take a picture of this, and then I'm going to mark it. Take a picture of this. Okay, David's done. Done. Philip's done. Garrett's done. Dr. M is done. Gloria is done. This is part of your take. If you look at these pictures, when you trade, you will have a big pitched winning percentage. If you can take a picture of this, if you can have this and say, me and look at this while you place your actual trades, pretty simple results. 
<clears throat> okay, I'm going to I'm going to delete this. Run time, or I shouldn't say running out of time. I should say that time is essence. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how a professional investor runs market entries, and I'm going to bring this up to live dates, and I'm going to give everyone the actual results section and they provide you what to do. First thing we need to determine is: is the market in the uptrend? We have our hand-drawn trend line. The market is in the uptrend. This is the Great British Pound per U.S. dollar for those of you that want to follow along. This is a daily time frame where every candle represents one. This is the lowest point of the trend, and this is the highest point of the trend. Right now, the current exchange rate is 7131, which means for every one U.S. for every one dollar and one cents U.S. is equal to one Great British Pound, or for every one Great British Pound you have is equal to dollar and 71 US. For those of you that live in Great Britain, you have to pay on the exchange rate to buy anything from the US. Be that as it may, I run this for Fibonacci. Fibonacci start from the lowest point of the trend. All I want you to do is watch done. Okay? The lowest point is the A, followed by the first high to left to the right B. A to B boundary. If you're thinking this is fast, this is to really look forward to because we're going to teach you how to analyze the market. We're abducting the market or analyzing and it takes you like three hours to analyze one chart. This program is really going to help speed that up. Um, it's just like riding a bike. Once you that bike, you're going to be good to go and you can do this anytime. In the, anytime, doesn't matter if it's 10 now or tomorrow. Okay, so we find our C by the deepest retracement. Because of May, we have a 5-0 retracement, making our D extension the 1.618. We please hold it to our Ds. Now, these are all daily time frames, and we're just a five market. When the market fulfills the projected D, the first high of two left to the right, D to the right, lower in the central high, becomes the actual confirmed D. C, B, A. And D becomes B. For those of you how far back in time, you have to go for as far back as the trend started. In this scenario, our trend is uh, July of 2013. So basically, we're one year ago. We have all the history and all this data to um, to bring us to the live market. For those that have this data available to you with your current charting software. We took wonders of charting data available. So it makes finding your Fibonacci's and ABCDs that Now, the market fulfilled the projected D. This is our confirmed D. D becomes D. Becomes D. Now, notice this. We're now two Fibonacci swings that have both paid out. So your two Fibonacci swings that have paid. Uh, C becomes D. We are in our, the B movement, which is removed. And then C to D gives us the 1.618 extension. So let's see. It begins to pull back to a 382 retracement. A little bit faster, 382 retrace. And you would take. This is not your D extension. The market has not penetrated. This is your D. Please be so kind of type in a yes if you can see that this month post never hit it, but retraced one more time, providing you another buying your hit confirmed D. Beautiful. So this is the third Fibonacci swing down a row. D becomes A. D becomes this process will repeat itself over and over and over and over. The great news is we have this all written down in a checklist format, which is super simple to need to show you in um, just a moment. Now, look at this short-term move. This is move is short-term. You could have sold the market after the D extension was hit. You could have made generated close to 400 pips in this pullback. only took 11 days to do it. That's where you begin to buy the market. 
the extension is the 1.6 range. Look how your interest is just buying this market. You're buying over and over and over. Any downward movement you begin to understand is a short-term move. And when you know whether you're in a short-term retracement, long-term, you have such a huge competitive edge. It is amazing. And able this target is 1.6 on the extension, yes or no? Okay. What happens when the market hits the D extension? What do you expect to do? What happens when the market hits the D extension? What is when this market hits the D extension? Old pullback. Tendon says reversal. Stanley says a pullback. OLA says a reversal. Let's go ahead and move our fibs. E becomes A. D becomes B. This is the current live up to my market Fibonacci's and for those of you who are trading this is what we're going to do. Okay. Is this market moving from the B to the C or is this market moving from the D? B to C. Is this a short term move or is this a long term move? Pips, are you expecting this market to pull back? Hey, Pips, do you expect the market to pull back? Brandon says at least two, at least two hundred. Remember, we we had everyone write it down. How? What is your takeaway? Pull back is going to be anywhere between two hundred and five hundred pips. Between 200 and 500, if the market pulled back at least 200, 500 pips, it's going to pull down the point of retracement. So, let me ask you this question: Do you have a edge looking at this market for the next 200 to 500 pips? Yes or no? Have to sell this market. By the way, you are able to sell this market at a high price first later on. For buying and selling currencies, which is cash. Cash is owned by countries. Countries can't go. Out. I know in the stock market, there's a lot of restrictions on when you can sell and when you can't. That's a norm. In the forex market, zero restrictions. You can you can make as much money going down the rally. We have a between a 200 and a 500 tip in front of us. So here comes the magic. We have our direction. We have a competitive edge. Now we're going to bring up a one-hour time frame. The top chart is a daily time frame. The bottom chart is a one-hour time frame. Same curves, just different time frames. One hour. Who's in control? Tell me. Is the daily time frame in control of the one hour, or is the one hour in control of the daily? Answer that question. You have to know that answer if you want to be really successful. If you, want, if you have some financial dreams and financial goals, you've got to be able to answer this question. It's actually really not that difficult. Larger time frames always control the direction of the smaller time frames. I just like how the parents control the children. The parents tell children what to do. Babysitters tell children what to do. Same relationship. Larger time frames always, and always wins hands down, no matter what. Okay, so if the daily time frame says that the one hour time frame is supposed to fall, all we want to do is set up for a trading plan. Okay, so all we want to do is look for the reversal. One of the ways that we're going to look for reversal is we're just going to use a simple hand-drawn trend line. Okay, this one-hour time frame separates the market into a buy zone and into a sell zone. All we have to do is wait for this market to enter into the sell zone. Furthermore, you can already begin to see 
the Fibonacci's are beginning to work. A, B, C, D, market's beginning to make lower lows, lower highs. Two questions. Is the one hour time frame starting to make lower lows and lower highs, yes or no? Right here. That's because the daily time frame says it's going to fall 200 pips. What we want to do here at Market Traders Institute is we want this market to break into our sell zone. We want the market to form a high, lower, and this high, and then we're going to sell it at the next counter trend line break, counsel formation, utilizing Fibonacci's and ABCDs. If this market on the one hour time frame gives us an A, B, C to D movement, here's my question to you. Would you be willing to risk 36 pips to make 82 pips? Yes or no? 36 pips with a 2,000 U.S. dollar investment, this is a 362 U.S. dollar risk. Our reward is 820 U.S. dollars. How many of you think you can do this for the next 200 to 500 pip move towards the south? If you really, really want to find out when this C is going to end, come join us in one of our client-only presentations where we actually do this live every day. And uh, we actually trade this in front of you live with real money, live accounts. Matter of fact, what I would like to do, um, I'd like to go ahead and bring you to our analyst on demand because I think it's kind of neat that you see that you can see this. Um, we'll go to VIP analyst on demand. What we have here at Market Traders Institute, we have a 24-hour broadcast, Monday through Friday, 24 hours a day. And that's what's on your screen. They're taking a small little break right now just to um, use the restroom, stretch, whatever. This is basically a commercial break. They're going to come back here in about literally five minutes or two or so minutes at 3.30 or 2.30. And this is you, the student. What we do is we broadcast our live charts and our live positions 24 hours a day. And we have staff members here. Or if you have a question regarding your trading, or want to find direction, or just the highest winning percentage trades of the day, log into this room. And we'll be more than happy to serve you, and not only show you, but we can also teach you how we did this. How many of you think that would be a huge competitive edge? By the way, this would be you speaking to our investors. Now, if you're wondering, is what's really the true worth of this? Let me show you some client testimonials of individuals just like yourself who have actually gone through our program, learned what you're learning now, uh, but at a much, much more of a, um, of a uh, grander, easier pace, I should say. Um, but let's look at some of the results. OK. Uh, Fernando made 32 pips trading non-farm payroll on Friday, which was 320 US dollars. Then he made 66 pips on the Australian dollar, Canadian dollar, which was another 660 US dollars. And then he generated 88 pips on the Euro Canadian dollar, which is another 880 US dollars. So basically, give or take, Fernando made about 2,000 US dollars in about two days of trading. OK, Peter says, um, I gained about 9% this month return on investment. And looking to gain, uh, with one day left Monday, I'm looking to gain 5.8% additional. So Peter's looking to gain about 15% return. Uh, here's Katrina, generated 165 pips today, made over 1,650 US dollars with a standard position. Total for the week, 334 pips. This is 3,340 US dollars. Uh, we just had an awesome trading uh, marathon, which was a whole lot of fun, where we actually got to trade live in front of you, the students. Um, great, great trade and see what we look for more results. Okay. Here's Katrina made another 250 pips. That's 2,500 US dollars. Let's see if we get some actual results going on, um, some snapshots. Here's Rick said made 431 pips. That's 4,310 US dollars. Uh, by the way, here at Market Traders Institute, we were voted in the top 10 bless, uh, top 10 companies to work for here in Orlando, Florida, which is a nice accomplishment. And there's a really nice money one, because I know a lot of you like to actually see results. Here's uh, Christopher. 
Christopher made over eight thousand seven hundred and fourteen US dollars last month for June. So let me ask you this question. Happy to me or yes if you would be pretty happy or pleased making seven hundred and sixty three pips or over eight thousand seven hundred US dollars this month. Roger says yes, William says yes, Paul says yes, Ray says yes, David says yes. Beautiful. Well, these are students just like yourself, and these are real life trades, and these are real life people, and um, they went through our program, which is which is quite neat. But anyways, I'm going to show you one last thing, and for those of you who are interested, I'll show you the entire details of our program. Um, type in a yes if you understand that on the Great British Pound U.S. dollar daily time frame, we hit our D extension. So we're waiting for a short-term move to be between the B to the C, which is between 200 and 500 pips, which means in the one-hour time frame, we can look to sell this market for, for about uh, 200 to 500 pips. We're waiting for an entry to set up that will provide us a risk of around 36 pips to a reward of 82 pips. This is a trading plan. It is a very logical, very proven methodology that has the highest winning percentage chance of working. At the end of the day, the biggest question is, will you take advantage of it, yes or no? That's completely up to you. What I want to show you is something that we understand. Uh, I want to show you something that you can begin to make money today with. Because we understand that you're going to have to learn how to do this yourself. As you go through our programs, we're going to be there every step of the way, side by side by side, teaching you. But there's a little learning curve. You know, there's no doubt about it. So I want to teach you and show you something that you can put in your hands. We can put them in your hands today, and you can make money today. And all I want you to do is ask yourself, can you do it? OK. <clears throat> Essentially, what we've done is we've begun to put Fibonacci's into a guided format. And where, because this market does the same things over and over and over again, uh, we've recognized the highest winning percentage patterns that repeat themselves in all the markets uh, or all the currency pairs here in the Forex. So this is what you're learning is going to be very universal in any time frame in any currency pair. Um, what it does is it counts the waves for you. It's going to let you know whether you're in a retracement or an extension um, automatically for you to where you can literally just trade this. Our traders are utilizing it, and they love it. And so all I want you to do is ask yourself, can you do it? Now, I'm going to explain it to you over the chart first, and I'll show you in a live market format. When this market moves, the market's going to make higher highs and higher lows. Move in an overall upward or bullish sequence. Your number one job is to determine if you're in an uptrend or downtrend by using your hand-drawn trend line. Where our FX Turbo Trader is, they'll automatically place the trend line for you, separating the market from a buy zone, sell zone. Second of all, once you determine your trend, you need to determine are you in a short-term retracement or in a long-term extension. Your short-term retracements or pullbacks will be marked in red. A red line will, will appear letting you know, hey, look, we're in a short-term pullback. You can just either hang out or to wait till we extend, or if you want to look to sell this market, take a higher risk trade, you can. Just understand this is a short-term move. When the market begins to extend, it will show green, letting you know it's a good idea to begin to buy the market when you're above and green. So before I show you this in the live market, just please be so kind and just type in a yes if you understand that the FX Turbo Trader will automatically separate the market from a buy zone, sell zone for you. And when the market's above, you're looking for green, looking to buy. Super, super simple. What I want to show you is a strategy that our head analyst likes to use. Uh, take some between four to six hours a week of realistically maintenance. Um, a lot of investors love this style of trading, but it serves two purposes. Number one, it will satisfy any short-term need of generating income. We're going to look to make about $1,000 a day with our first trade. Uh, we're also going to accomplish a residual income builder. For those of you out there that's looking to have your money make you money, you're really going to have to take what's called a position trade. And position trade just means you're holding a position for longer than a day. Positions can last weeks, they can last days, or they can last years, depending on how long-term you want to be. Be that as it may, let me show you how this works. It's actually really simple and pretty straightforward to use. 
If you can pick up on this and you think you can do this, you have a high winning percentage chance of hitting the ground running. Okay, so here's the deal. Here's our teal blue line separates the market from a buy zone and to a sell zone. The market just crossed above the teal blue line, letting us know it's time to buy the market. Now, we are going to buy this with two different trades. We are going to have a short-term trade and a long-term trade. Our short-term trade, we're going to close out in 24 hours. Our goal is to make $1,000 in 24 hours. Our second trade is a residual income trade, where you're going to enjoy your life, do whatever you want to do, and have the confidence you're generating income. So let's see what happens. Two trades, a short-term trade, long-term trade. Now, notice how when this market begins to run, it shows a green line letting you know there's a high winning percentage chance that you're still in an extension, which means you're in a good trade. In 24 hours, we just generated 102 pips. How many of you would be pretty happy or pretty pleased making 1,020 US dollars in 24 hours? Perfect. Your second trade, you're going to leave in. Basically, as you're going to use your hand-drawn trend line or your your automated trend line, this teal blue line, and as long as the market stays above the teal blue line, you will maintain your buy position. So realistically, commit between four to six hours a week and just say, hey, is the market still above my teal blue line? Am I still making money? If the answer is yes, you leave the trade alone. Sometimes you've got to stay away to get paid. During this time, you can do whatever you want. If you want to keep your day job and just make and generate income on the side on a weekly basis, this is a wonderful strategy to utilize. Remember, you can check your charts before or after your work, maybe even at lunchtime if you want. It's really not, not that struggle with time commitment. When the market crosses below the teal blue line, you exit your position. So your residual income trade, you generated 217 pips which is equivalent to 2,170 US dollars. A little longer trade, but hey, you generated pretty much twice as much as you made in one single day. And you really didn't have to do anything to do to earn it, which is quite nice. Now, we're now going to reverse our position. We're now going to enter into selling this market. Same rules apply, but opposite. We're going to sell it with two positions. One position will be short term, second position will be long term. Within 24 hours, we're going to look to close out wherever the market's at. Notice how you have this red line letting you know that we're still extending. In 24 hours, we generated 133 pips. Not too bad. We accomplished our goal of generating over 1,000 US dollars in the first day. That's 1,330 US dollars, and you have a second position trade. Uh, Gloria says, do you have to monitor this? In this scenario, you have to commit at least four to six hours a week. That's it. Basically, what you're going to do, because every candlestick represents one hour, you're just going to log on your chart and you're going to say, hey, is the market still below my teal blue line? Am I still making money? If you can answer yes to both those questions, then you leave your trade alone. And because you're dealing with a little bit of a larger time frame, it's not as if you're going to need a whole lot of time throughout the week few times, you know, once or twice a day, you should be just fine. Here's the exit, 161 pips. So 161 pips or 1,610 US dollars generated to basically enjoy your quality of life, to do whatever you wanted to do. Now, the market's back above the two blue line, we're going to buy. And the neat thing about this is one of the things you're going to learn about trading is there is no such thing as 100% or absolutes or guarantees or undefeated seasons. You may have heard me say that a few times throughout this presentation. And what that basically means is this. It doesn't matter how good of a trader you are. Every now and then you're going to lose. Just what happens. And so you're going to need to protect yourself. And how you protect yourself is trading with good equity management. Pretty simple, pretty straightforward. If you're going to lose, or excuse me, if you're going to win $1,600 a trade, lose less. Our FX Turbo Trader has designed equity management inside of here to really assist you to lose a whole lot less. Let me show you what I mean. You buy this market, and notice how this teal blue line, I'm going to zoom in a little bit, is snugged right against or underneath the candlesticks. 
So when this market does not go your way, and this is just a bad trade, you actually get an early exit where you only lose 20 pips. You just lost 200 US dollars. You had two trades, so you lost 400 total. But if you're losing $200 a trade, but you're generating over 1,600, 1,300, 2,000 US dollars a trade, you're in pretty good shape, wouldn't you agree? So now it's time to sell this market, and here's the overall goal with this trade. When you win, you need to win more than you lose. So your next win really needs to make up the past losses. Let's see if we can do that. In 24 hours, we just generated 73 pips, which is equivalent to 730 US dollars. Did our very next win make up our two losses, yes or no? And did we accomplish our goal? Yes, we did. Our residual income trade, we walked away with eight pips. Not a huge winner, but 80 US dollars is still 80 US dollars. Okay, so as this trade is in, let me ask you this question. How many of you are at home watching this and you're saying to yourself, hey, I think I can start making money pretty much right away using this? Get a return on your investment. That you can really envision yourself buying the market when it enters into the buy zone and using this as a guided format. That's Lee, that's Ray, that's Williams, that's Lisa, that's Philip, that's Pete. How many of you would be pretty happy generating 85 pips or 850 US dollars in a 24-hour period? And more importantly, how many of you are really searching for a residual income style of trading to where you can spend time the way you're spending, the way you want to spend time? Take your wife, your husband, your significant other out to dinner and have confidence you're generating income. Go to your son's football game or your daughter's dance recital. Spend the time focusing on quality of life and have the confidence to generate income because that's the whole purpose of a residual income builder. That's 153 pips. That's the equivalent to 1,530 US dollars. What I would like to do is add up these results and kindly show the investors who think that this is something that they can do, what type of expectation that you should have utilizing something like this. Because I think that's very important. Expectations are key. 1,020 plus 2,170 plus 1,330 plus 1,530 US dollars plus 730 plus 80 plus 1,610 plus 850. Minus 200 minus 200 is 8,920 US dollars. 8,920 US dollars in about six weeks of trading with only a 2,000 US dollar investment per trade. So here's my question before I show you how to get involved with our program. Ladies and gentlemen, if I can show you how to take a 2,000 US dollar investment per trade and generate 8,920 US dollars in six weeks, and then you can apply that skill week after week after week for the rest of your life, would you let Market Traders Institute train you on how to trade the Forex market? Yes or no? William says yes. Lee says yes. Roger says yes. Daniel says yes. Ray says yes. Olga says yes. Uh, Pete, Philip, Julio, Grant says yes. Let me show you one last testimonial and social proof before I show you how to get involved in our program. I was just like you. I was a personal trainer before I became a Forex trader with the Market Traders Institute. And I said yes. Here are my personal results. This is myfxbook.com. This is third party verified. My track record is verified. My trading privilege is verified. My, when I first opened up this trading account, I had 500 US dollars. That was my initial deposit investment. When I first started investing, I was losing $4 per trade, making $5 per trade, really making zero headway, 
and uh, not too crazy worth of life-changing results. I said yes, and I joined Market Traders Institute's program and learned exactly how to trade the correct way. Within a few months, I started making $173 a trade, $413 a trade, $305 a trade, completely changed my, my trading style, only losing around $78 a trade. I stuck with it about a year and a half later, $2,309 a trade. $2,508 a trade, making $4,560 U.S. dollars a trade. Withdrawing $10,000 U.S. dollars at a time, having days where I generate $7,598 U.S. dollars. Please be so kind to type in a yes if you can see that I have a gain of 4,967.6% return on my initial deposit investments. And here's my biggest question to you. Ladies and gentlemen, if we taught you how to trade the Forex market. If you learn from an establishment that has been training successfully for over 20 years and has trained over 30,000 clients worldwide who has, a, who has a blueprint for training successful traders. If you learn Fibonacci's were prevented the turbo trader and understood your ABCDs and provided, and we had lifetime support, do you think you'd be our next success story? Do you think you spend more time with your friends, family, loved ones? Do you think your quality of life would go up? And would an extra two to five thousand US dollars of immediate return on your investment begin to make a few things change for you? If your answer is yes, let me introduce you to students who said yes, just like you. This is John G. John G was skeptical of our program simply because of his age. He felt as if um, he was a little bit too old to learn a life skill like this, so he's kind of hesitant. Uh, but this is what he says. He says, that's where the chief came in, and he brought it down to my level. And he made me understand. He also made me understand that I don't have to know everything. I can learn it as I go, and I can go from here. But he gave me the opportunity to get started. John G. joined our program, was able to retire, and is enjoying his retirement as a Forex trader. This is John R. from Texas. John R. says, what they teach you, how they teach you, when to get in, when to get out, when to stay out. That's a big thing. Basically, a full understanding of how the market works. John R., who's an engineer, does this part-time. And within just six weeks of joining our program, he tripled his trading account. Here's Stanley M. from California. He says, it made everything so simple, like a roadmap. I've had other courses that gave me a lot of information but never really tied things together like MTI has. I'm proud to announce that Stanley M went through our program, was able to retire, and is enjoying his retirement as a Forex trader. We believe that you too can accomplish your financial goals and your financial dreams by utilizing the ultimate traders package on demand. This is your on demand this package is the most complete, turnkey, easy to use, step by step trading room available in this world today. And this is what you're going to receive if you decide to move forward with our program. We're going to have a certification with our Wealth and Freedom Experience live event. You can have the ability to either attend in person or you can watch the comfort of your own as we will broadcast this over the internet for you. To this three-day event, we're going to teach you, uh, we will teach you seven different exclusive MTI trading strategies, where you will gain edge on 99% of all Forex traders. You will leave with a full and complete understanding, confidence from an instructor-led education, and potentially transform your life. On the third day, we will try to you giving you the ability to mimic not only our results, but also you can see how this is done in real life. Our next Wealth and Freedom three-day experience is July the 12th. There's only 19 seats left. You will receive lifetime education, which means you can access this over and over and over again as many times as you like. You will also receive our Financial Freedom Online University. And I wanted to include this today so you can have a step-by-step -step learning package to ensure that you understand how to properly trade the Forex market. Because this is where the trading begins. 
I wanted you to have this so we can ensure that all your questions will be answered. You will have access to this for an entire lifetime. If you liked what I showed you with the Fibonacci's and ABCD's, then this is going to be perfect for you. Now, I want to give you our Wealth Acceleration Software Package, 12 months included. Inside this package is all the technologies and all the systems. You have the Fibonacci, the Treble Trader, as well as 200 customizable indicators. Time-tested, that's very important, time-tested training systems, email and alarm functionalities, Turbo Trader, the FX Turbo Trader, the Cable Trader, Pulse Trader, and which can all be automated, either in a guided sequence or built into residual income. And what I mean by that is if you were to connect to two of our automated systems, in the last 12 months they have averaged generating 1000 US dollars a piece, month after month after month, with very little intervention of yourself. You also receive our rapid results profit plan because we want you to succeed quickly because your success is our success. So we've added this plan of action to protect your capital while ensuring rapid growth. You also receive a success now roadmap because we want you to find the places, the best places to be successful when trading and know exactly where to look so you can start making money now. Both of these you have access for an entire lifetime. Now remember our analysts on demand? We're going to give you 12 months included. In our analyst on demand, what this is is a 24-hour forecast, Monday through Friday, where we will forecast our positions and our direction of the market. You will, all you need to do is log into this room, and you'll be provided the highest winning percentage trading opportunities of the day. Talk about the ultimate confirmation. If you have a trade that you would like to have reviewed, log into this room. We have staff, professional investors who are eager to serve you and provide you the ultimate confirmation of whether it is a good trade or whether it is a bad trade. Now, you're going to receive our step-by-step -step pro traders checklist access for an entire lifetime. This step-by-step -step pro traders checklist, if you're anything like me, you're going to want this to avoid costly mistakes. Furthermore, this gives you a bonus feature in which it will give you a percentage on whether your trades will work out or not. So you can literally pick and choose from 70, 80, or 90% winning trades and avoid all the rest. If you're looking for mentorship, let me introduce to you the FXG Fast Track Mentorship. Picture this. <clears throat> Imagine having a 25-year veteran, an industry pioneer, a top-selling author, the creator of our ultimate traders package and comfort your own home, taking you by the hand, showing you what to do step by step by step, and potentially making money. This is our FXG Fast Track Mentorship where you have access for an entire lifetime. So let's go over this again. You'll receive the Ultimate Traders Package On Demand. This is your On Demand Financial Freedom Solution. You're going to receive the Wealth and Freedom Experience Live three-day event, the Financial Freedom Online University, the Wealth Acceleration Software Package, the Analyst On Demand, the Step-by-Step -step Pro Traders Checklist, the FXG Fast Track Mentorship, the Rapid Results Profit Plan, and the Success Now Roadmap but it's all a total value of $12,610 US dollars. Let me ask you this question. Now go ahead and type your responses in the chat box. If all this package did for you was teach you and show you how to generate between five and 10,000 US dollars a month, month after month after month for the rest of your life, would it be worth the investment, yes or no? If all this package did for you is teach you, show you how to generate the income to retire with, would it be worth the investment? Yes or no? And if all this package did for you was teach you, show you how to generate enough money to travel around the world, spend more time with your friends, family, loved ones, would it be worth the investment? Yes or yes? Now my friends, I am so passionate about your success that when you do the right thing, you take action right now, you'll receive my personal 100% ironclad money back guarantee. What this means is that this is a zero risk opportunity for you. You will have 60 days or two calendar months to go through our entire program. And if you're not completely satisfied, we'll give you all your money back, making this a zero risk opportunity. For those of you that would like to get involved in a zero risk learning opportunity, my education specialists are listening to me right now. All I need you to do is type your telephone number in the question section box. Just put zero risk next to your telephone number and 
My education specialist will hear me call out your name, and they'll understand that you want to get involved at a zero risk. I want to go ahead and congratulate the following students. Thank you, Roger. I have your telephone number, and I see you put zero risk. We're going to contact you here in a few moments. Thank you, Lee. I have your telephone number. Our education specialist will contact you, and I see you put zero risk. Thank you, Philip and Diane. For everyone else, I want you to understand that I came here to serve. I came here to empower. I came here to teach you enough information to allow you to make a conscious decision to change your financial future for the better. I also came here to make things very affordable. Tomorrow, we are having what's called the MTI tipping point. What this is is a $30,000 trading opportunity. Some of our students are generating upwards between upwards of $8,000 US dollars a week with this prediction, where we are identifying entries and exit points, and we're going to teach you in detail how you too can do this. Because of that, we just want to get you involved. But we can't do this for everyone. I have 10 seats available to get you involved with the NCI tipping point prediction. And for the first 10 of you will not be paying 12,610 US dollars. The first 10 individuals that type their telephone numbers in this question section box right now, your risk-free investment will just be 74.95. And if that's not good enough, when you pay in full, we'll save you an additional 2,000 US dollars off. You'll be invited to our tipping point prediction, which is tomorrow night, which is a $30,000 trading opportunity, and your final price just $54.95. You now have my permission to type your telephone number in this question section box, and I'm going to call out your name. My education specialist will know that you're going to be getting involved with our MTI tipping point. Uh, Salji, I have your telephone number. Our education specialist will contact you here in a few moments. I have nine seats available. Thank you, Grant. I have your telephone number. Our education specialist will contact you here in a few moments. And I have eight seats available. Uh, thank you, Fabio. I have your telephone number. Our education specialist will contact you here in a few moments. And I have seven seats left. Thank you, Fabio. I have your telephone number. Now have six seats left. The next six individuals that type their telephone number in this question section box will get involved immediately with our MTI tipping point prediction, which is a $30,000 US dollar trading opportunity, which is taking place tomorrow night. Thank you, Philip. I have your telephone number. Education specialist will contact you. We have now six seats left. If you're wondering if we have uh, any sort of payment preference plan, the answer is yes. Take a look at your screen. We do provide 100% approval. All I really need you to do is let me know what option best fits you. And I'm going to explain option A and option B in detail. Option A. For today only, we'll save you an additional 2,000 US dollars, which means that your final price is just 54.95. Option B is our easy pay program, where you're going to put 1,000 US dollars down, and we'll have customizable payments for you. Now, once again, Option A, when you pay in full, you will save 2,000 US dollars. You will receive a 60-day 100% satisfaction guarantee, which makes this a zero-risk trading opportunity. Furthermore, you'll be invited in a 30,000 US dollar trading prediction, which is tomorrow night, called the MTI tipping point. Option B is our easy pay program, where you just take $1,000 off. There is no additional savings, but we'll have customizable payments for you. Please be so kind and let us know option A or option B and which payment or option best fits you. Thank you, Carol. I have your telephone number. I see you put sell. Not a problem. We now have five seats available. Please be so kind and let us know option A or option B. Uh, Grant, Fabio, Theo, Saji, please be so kind and let us know option A or option B. Thank you, Philip. I have you for option A. You're going to take advantage of the $2,000 US savings, which means your final price is $54.95. Absolutely, you will receive a zero risk opportunity. And option A as well, you will be invited to our MTI tipping point prediction, which is a 30,000 US dollar trading opportunity. Thank you, Pia. I have you for option B, not a problem. Uh, you're going to get involved in our easy pay program. You're going to put 1,000 US dollars down today, and the rest will be broken up into customizable payments. Thank you, Melissa. I have your telephone number. And I see you, option A. We now have four seats available. 
And thank you, Tyler. Have your telephone number. I see you took option A, the one-time payment at fifty-four ninety-five. Not a problem. We now have three seats left. Thank you, Fabio. Have you for option B? You're going to do our easy pay program. Put a thousand U.S. dollars down. Now there is three seats available, still remaining, at our introductory price for our MTI tipping point prediction. And I'd like to ask this question for those of you who are in the room. And please be so kind to participate in this section. Type in a yes in the question section box. If I've shown you enough information to allow you to make a conscious decision, to say yes, I want to be a Forex trader. I type in a yes in the question section box. If I've shown you enough information to allow you to make a conscious decision, to say yes, I can have fun being a Forex trader. And type it a yes in the question section box. If Market Traders Institute can teach you how to take a two thousand U.S. dollar investment per trade and generate between five and ten thousand U.S. dollars a month, month after month after month for the rest of your life, provide you lifetime education and lifetime support and back it up with a 60-day, zero-risk, 100% satisfaction guarantee. If you're typing in yes, I want to ask you this question. Are you worth the investment? If the answer is yes, then take action now. Yuri, please be so kind to type your telephone number in the question section box. Victor, Grant, Alex, please be so kind to type in your telephone number in the question section box. Your risk-free investment is just $74.95. Tomorrow, we're having our tipping point prediction to where you will save an additional $2,000 U.S. dollars when you pay in full, making your final price just $54.95. 100% approval to get started. Option A, one-time payment, save an additional $2,000 U.S. dollars, receive a 60-day 100% satisfaction guarantee, and be invited to our $30,000 U.S. dollar tipping point prediction. Option B is our easy pay program. All you do is put $1,000 U.S. dollars down today, and we'll customize monthly payments for you. Put the education inside your hands today. Get working on the FX Turbo Trader immediately. Just understand there is no additional savings for option B. Thank you so much, Yuri. I have your telephone number. Education specialist will contact me here in a few moments. Thank you, Roger. I have your telephone number. There's one last seat left. And thank you, Thales. What if I could do one better? What if I could show you how to receive this entire education absolutely for free? Lifetime education, lifetime support, $30,000 trading opportunity, absolutely for free. Well, I'm going to get to do something pretty neat today that I haven't been able to do in a while. Here at Market Traders Institute, we've been trading or training traders for 20 years. And we have done this successfully and trained over 30,000 clients from all corners of the world. So what we're going to do it's for the next one minute, 60 seconds. Anyone who types their telephone number in this question section box and puts free next to their telephone number, for the next 60 seconds, I'll have one of my education specialists contact you. And they will properly explain what you need to do to receive the entire education absolutely for free. So this way we can get you involved into the trading prediction tomorrow, which is a $30,000 US dollar trading opportunity. Time starts now. You now have 55 seconds left to type your telephone number in the question section box and put free next to it. Thank you, Thabo. Alex, have your telephone number. I see you put free next to it. Thank you, Thabo. Grant, William, have your telephone number. I see you put free next to it. Our education specialist contact here in a few moments. Thank you, William, Damien, Kathy, have your telephone number. Education specialist contact here in a few moments. There's now 35 seconds to anyone who types their telephone number in the question section box. I'll have one of my education specialists contact you to let you know exactly what you need to do to receive this entire program absolutely for free and get involved in tomorrow's night's tipping point prediction.
There's now 20 seconds left. Thank you, Winnie. Have your telephone number. Thank you, Ray and Damian, Grant, Yuri. Have your telephone number. Education specialist contacting here in a few moments. Thank you, Gary. See what you wrote. Not a problem, my friend. Our education specialist contact you. We now have five, four, three, two, one. I want to go ahead and say thank you to each and every one of you for giving us the opportunity to speak with you in regards to the Forex market. We have huge passion uh, in regards to serving you and teaching you how to trade the Forex market. If you give us the opportunity to train you, not only are we dedicated, but I promise you we are dedicated to surpassing your expectations. Don't forget to join us tomorrow where we're going to be planning your first trade like a 20-year trading pro. Don't miss out. It's going to be tomorrow. Make sure you check your emails. We'll go ahead and automatically invite you. For those of you who are excited enough, go ahead and give us a call, 407-585-2407. Once again, tomorrow we'll be planning our first trade like a 20-year pro. For those of you who are struggling with entries on how to enter in um, the first time or how to enter in with the highest 20% of the chance that the market is just going to go your way, you really are not going to want to miss this. This is going to be beautifully coupled with the Fibonacci's and ABCD's that you just learned today. But on that note, every day, helping traders find a way. This is Joshua Martinez out. Stay by your phones. We're contacting you now.